Today, Theo joins her mother, Barry, for a day of work at the Karma Organic Spa in Inglewood, New Jersey. Wait, that's the color you picked? But she becomes a huge distraction. Mom, can you help me braid my doll's hair? Mom, I want to draw a portrait of you. Mom, my iPad's not working. Preventing her mom from doing her job. Mom, I want to make you a bracelet. Sure, sweetie, that'd be great. Do you want Theo to make you a bracelet too? No. If you unknowingly book an appointment with this manicurist... It's not working. Okay, we'll figure it out, don't worry. ...and get her daughter to... Come closer. What would you do? Couple minutes. Oh, sit down, sit down. This first customer has stopped in for what she hopes is a quick manicure. I work around nearby, but I only have 30 minutes. You're just getting a manicure? Yeah, just a quick manicure. I just got a pedicure yesterday. Little does she know, this appointment okay. comes with a few extras. Mom, I want to draw a portrait of you. Okay, sweetheart, go ahead. But you have to look at me. Oh, sure, sweetheart, go ahead. While this little artist works on her masterpiece, you can do your nose. The customer quite literally starts taking matters into her own hands. Look, isn't she a really good artist? Yeah. That's really good. Here, do you want this? Here, go ahead. Wait, go ahead. who's the worker here? Oh, go ahead, don't worry. Looks great. <laughs> that looks really good. Do you want me to open the file for you? I'm really excited to have my daughter here. Do you need one more? Are you okay? I don't know. You stopped, so I just... No, do you need one more to finish? Here. Well, I thought you were doing it. She'll be done in a couple of minutes. This customer doesn't have a couple of minutes. Mom, look at me. And the appointment gets even longer when Theo jumps back in with yet another distraction. Five, six. Barry counts. And the customer <laughs> seems to get more annoyed by the second. You need another? No, I'm good. You got a little on that now. You know what? I'm going to come back. One more time. Please. Okay. I'm just going to take this off and I'm going to go. You sure? Yes. And okay. with that, this customer has had enough. We catch up with her outside. John Quinones, how are you? What would you do? <laughs> what did you think of our manicurist? Uh, she was like great. She was like a great mother. But she wasn't very professional. She's like, dude, you want to continue? I'm like, not really. We're back inside. Now will this next customer, a mother herself, have the patience to wait for Theo's jump rope routine? You have to look at Go ahead. I'm looking, I'm looking. One, two, three. Come on, count with me. Four, five, six, seven. Yay! Yay! Isn't she awesome? She is. I, I think kids are awesome. She thinks Theo is awesome. Mom, I'm bored. Until mom puts her daughter before her customer. You want a snack? Yeah. I'll be back in a second. We send mom and daughter away so we can bring in the manager. That's Lorraine, another one of our actors. Hi, how are you? Is everything okay? Everything's fine. Okay. Where's the other lady that was here? She's asking for another manicurist. Oh, do you prefer her? No, no, no. Oh, okay. It's fine. Okay, okay. Um, Barry returns, and the manager tells her to polish up her customer service skills. Yeah, as long as we just focus on our time. She was okay. a little hungry. But moments later, her attention is right back on her daughter. Mom, her hair's like falling out. Okay, okay. Make it really tight. You want me to do it? Let me just wash my hands off. One second. Little Theo even offers to help out on the workload. Do you want me to paint your nails? It's okay. I can do it really quick. <laughs> okay. What do you want done to the hair? With the customer's patience running low, we send the manager back in. Ask the woman, is she delaying your manicure? Would you like someone else? Yeah, I actually have to. I, I'm in a rush. Barry, I'm sorry. What? She She's in a rush, and so we may need to get it's someone okay, else. It's okay, I'll it. That's my cue. Yeah, John, you could uh, stand by and get ready. To step in and say hello. Hi there. I'm John Quinones. You okay? I You're see you on TV all the time. <laughs> you watch the show. You guys stole all the bedware with the yes, cameras. Yes, they're all good. <laughs> what did you think of our manicurist uh, and the fact that she brought her daughter to work? That I have no problem with because I have my children. I didn't want to make her feel bad, but I also need to keep my kids' schedule as well as mine. <laughs> These final customers have booked an appointment for a pedicure. I 
guys married? We are married. Oh. Will this happy couple stay happy throughout this ordeal? There you go. Get something to play with. Can you braid her hair? Sure. And believe it or not, yeah. now our distracted mom asks the customer to lend a helping hand. Will you get it for me? Let me too. Yeah, that'd be awesome. Here. The couple look at each other in disbelief. There you go, sweetheart. Let me braid your hair. You almost done? Almost. OK. Just give me a holler. You ready? Oh, OK, good, good, good. Let me just finish her hair. We're way into the appointment, and Barry is just now finally touching the customer's feet for the first time. I got a hangnail over here. They're shocked. And her husband whispers for her to get up. Mommy has to count. And now again, Theo takes out that jump rope. I'm going to jump rope to 10, and then we'll do more at home. OK, go ahead. He's angry. Well, he's really upset. Huh? Three, count a little louder. Four, five, six, seven. That's it. <laughs> Fed up, she eventually gets up. You know what? I have to run to the bathroom. I'm sorry. Trying to walk out on that pedicure. Hi, guys. <laughs> How are you? You OK? Oh, my God! <laughs> I think you were a little upset. <laughs> I'm like, are you kidding? Hi there. How are you? I'm John Quinones. I know exactly who you are. How long were you going to take this? When we hike so much, my feet need it. And I was like, we're not going anywhere, but maybe she can get somebody different. <laughs> okay. I was going to say I had a bellyache, and I needed the restroom. I was going to hang out yeah. and take my phone and call on the phone and call him. I didn't want to make a scene, especially for her. I couldn't believe she kept stopping. I said, there's no way we could pay for this. I kept looking at her, get up. We're not paying for this. No, Just get up. Saying, like, get up. Get up now. <laughs> You know, it also, too, it's like I'm in a service business. Yeah. You know, I wouldn't expect myself to get paid if I didn't give my all. Thanks. 